Hey everybody, it's Chugga Conroy! Welcome back to more Animal Crossing New Leaf! Last time! We celebrated the Strangely Time Fireworks Festival in the middle of August, and I got these awesome little bobbers on my head. We also met a new friend around town, but this time we are here to celebrate the lovable Panda Chester's birthday. I got one letter in my mailbox from Molly! Greetings, Emil. I love to read books, and I'm also addicted to writing. I practice all the time. Does that make me a wordaholic? <laughs> I'm just working on making my jokes. Sincerely, Molly. Uh, if you ever need to make some terrible jokes, I can definitely be there for you. I'll go ahead and toss that one, just because I'm running out of space to save all my letters. Seriously, they should really give you more. Uh, I wish they'd give you more storage for items as well, but that's besides the point. Uh, let's head on over to Chester's immediately. Chester hasn't really been getting a whole lot of love recently in these videos. He just doesn't really seem to be around all that much. So, uh, let's pop in and see him on his special day. And I'm really curious to see who Chester's best friend is, because he doesn't really talk about other animals that much. Uh, let's see. Uh, Shari! Wow, Ebot. I'm so happy that you're here to celebrate my birthday with me. Uh... Like I've said before, separated at birth, uh, they have very similar faces. Uh, okay. Hey, hey, dude! Yeah, she started calling me dude. I don't really get it. I guess it's better than... Well, she called me Skippy for a while, but you know what I mean. Well, let's get the party started then. Cheeky? At least she still says cheeky. You know, that is the trademark thing. Just for today, no matter what anybody says, Chester is the main event. Gotta show him a good time. You know any good jokes or, have, or anything? Have at it, cheeky. Uh, well... <laughs> I don't really have a good joke about Chester, personally, but, uh, uh, I do have a pretty good present for him. How about we talk to him and give it to him? <laughs> today is all about me! Everyone just give me a present, so Eva, did you bring me something too? Uh, yeah, I did. I would not have the heart to say I forgot, even if I really did. I would just make up something. Alright, now, I don't know how well Chester is going to like this, but I thought there was no more fitting present than this item. So let's see how it goes over. I'm trying to guess what it is by smelling it. <laughs> you do that, buddy. A karumatsu! So impressed you picked out the perfect present! Yes! Yes! Can't, don't, will not tell you how happy that makes me that he likes that. Uh, for those that don't know, the karumatsu looks like this. Yeah, I don't think there's any better item to give a panda. <laughs> and I love how his catchphrase is bamboozled. <laughs> I wish it was my birthday every day, but then I'd be an old man in, like, no time, bamboozled. <laughs> Chester, you're a fun guy. I gotta say, we didn't really hang out with you enough, like, in the recently in these videos. Just, like, he's so funny. I just, I love his company. <laughs> and why not? We'll talk with you one more time, Shari. Haven't invited parties like this any old time, cheeky. It's really odd. Shari is unusually close with a lot of these animals. Oh, wait up! Thanks for coming today. Thanks for the present. You just made, my, made this the best birthday ever. Later, bamboozled. <laughs> uh, it makes me really happy that he did that, though, because I didn't look at the list of items that Chester liked. I just knew that I wanted to give him that one, and it's like, if he hated it, I didn't know what I was going to do, just because that is the perfect item for him. It just, it's so good. All right. So, uh, that does it for the main event today. Uh, yeah, Chester was the main event, as put by Shari. But uh, I want to head up to Main Street, because as Isabel was telling us at the start there, we have a new shop on Main Street, yeah. Um, this was something I wasn't even sure I was gonna get to show off because in my personal Animal Crossing town, I never unlocked this, but I sure enough did it here. Uh, if you look down at the bottom screen, you can see that there is an icon right there. The Fortune Teller. Hmm, an icon? <laughs> Once Katrina has visited your town 20 times, or rather, after you've just paid to get a reading from her 20 times, it can be in other people's towns. This whole area is really flashy looking now. It changed a lot more than I thought, and actually, is there- Yeah, this sign over here is new as well. That is cool. I don't know what it says. It doesn't look like Japanese to me, but okay. Uh, let's go on inside. Uh, what?! I missed it by four minutes. Really? I'll see you guys in the morning. You know, for a fortune teller, you sure close really early. I mean, I thought, like, fortune tellers were supposed to be open, like, really late, you know, so that, like, they could channel, like, the energy of the cosmos or something like that. But yeah, it's 1020 the next morning. Let's step inside. I've been dying to see what the inside of this place looks like. I've never seen it in... It's the exact same as her tent. Really? 
Wow, well, I guess it looks a little bit different though, but not much. Come on. Even her place in, uh, in City Folk look different than this. Alright, let's just talk to her. Kihama ata, kihama ata ta, yiha ta ta ta. The stars of Ares and Owise Mare's guidance have caused me to settle in Pallet. If you ever get lost on the path, you may come and visit me in my parlor here. Now that that is out of the way, I can sense it. The great happiness from the stars attempting to visit you. My uh, money meter thing has come down. So, yep, she wants money. <laughs> let's give her that. All right, let's see what this is like. Bring your star matrix into view. Have a seat. Wasn't necessary to talk because it actually does sound pretty similar to what she's saying. Aha, yes, it has come into view. While the plants sleep at midnight, one, two, counts the president of Nook's homes, bells, not plants. From this place I see the signs. Oh, yes, I can. I see good fortune upon wealth. Unisex accessory. Try saying that five times fast. This uh, will be this item will be the key to finding or to truly unlocking your good fortune. I like how my bobbers were glowing in that. That was really cool. Is he already wearing a lucky item? Oh, okay. Uh, all right. Sure. I'll take it. I'll take a free reading. So, yeah, I got her to set up shop in this town immediately after I got the lovely phone anyway, so it was completely pointless. You don't even need her when you have the lovely phone. So, that was kind of lame. Uh, it is now August 7th. For those that might be confused about the dates, just because it's been a while since I've stated this, uh, my 3DS clock is always set 24 hours ahead, so that I always have time to edit these videos before they get posted. And as such, it is the morning of August 7th before this video is getting po- or, um, August, uh, 6th before this video is getting posted, and thus it is August 7th in my 3DS clock. Uh, we have a letter right here. Uh, let's see what it is. Uh, sure enough, it's what I thought it was. It's, uh, yeah, Chester, okay. Uh, toss this letter from Rocco. Just gotta make room for it. Okay, Chester! Dear Mill, thanks for coming to my birthday party. I showed up your present to a buddy of mine. Now he wants to be your friend too. He, he could just tell how cool you are from Chester. Uh, I don't know, maybe he was talking about Chow because Chow is a panda bear and, you know, he's a character in Animal Crossing. He doesn't live here, obviously, but, you know, maybe you could have been talking about him. Uh, what did he give me? A sawhorse. Okay. Uh, you know, before we end this off, I know this is kind of like a shorter update and there's not really a whole lot to this though, but that's just because we kind of just had an update and I've already shown everything I wanted to show here today. Oh, and uh, in one more day as well. Uh, Chester is home. I do want to see what his uh, place is looking like if he put that thing up already, because he probably has. Let's see. Uh, okay, cool, he did. Uh, he put it next to the trash. Uh, oh, I get it. He, uh, he wants to, uh, eat, and then just kind of, like, throw the scraps into the garbage conveniently. Thinking ahead, Chester, I see. Awesome. Okay. Let's talk to him. Yeah, I came by for a visit. Uh, let's talk. I apologize, but I'm fresh out of fruit parfait. Fine, then. I see how it is. Don't save any for me. Hmm. Okay, that's really all I wanted to do. We got to see Chester after his birthday was over. He had a really nice birthday, though, so yeah. Like I said before, Chester is one of my more favorite animals. A lot of people seemed really jealous that I had him in the comments and things like that. Then again, I tend to get really good animals, not gonna lie. I have been very lucky with that. Uh, so, I guess uh, we're having our goodbye at 10 o'clock in the morning this time, technically. I, I don't know. I, this isn't the first time that a video has technically taken place over the course of two calendar days, so yeah. Anyway, what will we miss between now and the next update? Well, believe it or not, a few things. Uh, first off, on August 8th, which is now tomorrow, actually, or two days for you guys, never mind, um, your mother will always send you a shaved ice maker on that day. We're not going to be making an update for that just because it's a letter and not really, like, an event. Uh, on the 16th, there is a bug off. Um, same as all the other bug offs, not really anything special there. We've already shown that, so don't need to show it. Our next update is going to be on August 18th. For Rocco's birthday. Another underappreciated animal living here in Pallet. So, next time an Animal Crossing New Leaf, we'll celebrate Rocco's birthday with him. Also, thanks for your patience with Xenoblade Chronicles. It's just that I've been kind of sick these past couple of weeks, plus I've been traveling a lot before that, and I just haven't been able to make videos. I had to, like, really, really struggle to get this video out right, you know, on time, just because I didn't want to, like, miss an Animal Crossing day because it's in real time. So, hopefully we'll return to updating soon. I really, really want to. 
So, yeah, it's not me being lazy or anything like that. It's just that the videos are mostly done, but I can't quite finish them. All right? All that being said, see you guys then.